What is up guys, Apathy back in the building today with another video and today is a video that I should have done a long time ago but I never did and that's why today I am doing it because it has to be done and a big reason is because I still get asked the same question, what team am I on, who am I teaming with, what org am I on, who are my teammates and today I'm here to clear it at all, a lot of people that follow me on Twitter, Twitch, YouTube, everything and you follow me as a player and you, you, you like me and you want to know who or what I'm doing. Well, a lot of you guys, I never posted a YouTube video really explaining about any of this. All I posted was me leaving Envy. Envy announced their squad today. You know, it's Hugh, Slasher, Temp, and Classic. So today, um, even though this was announced already, I'm still going to be talking about it. I'm, you guys know I'm on EG now. I joined Evil Geniuses. I'm teaming with Aches, Nameless, and Enable. As you can see, I'm wearing the EG hat. Nice little EG hat in here for the video. And I just want to talk about, you guys know all this. A lot of you guys know this already, what team I am on, the teammates I'm playing with. If you didn't know, well, that's the team I'm now on. And Evil Genius is loving them so far. They're treating us like, they're treating us so great. And it's, it's perfect. I'm loving the organization. I'm loving everything about it. And today, I'm also going to talk a little bit about my teammates. So I want to, that's the main point of this video. You know, not only not announcing who my teammate with, if you didn't know, and what org I'm with, but a little bit about my teammates so a lot of you guys know i'm teaming with aches I, I don't even know how many one events he's won now i think it's 22 20 21 22 events um i've teamed with aches before i've had some success when i teamed with him we won an event we placed and we got a second place at the same in the same game so i've had some success with aches um you know we 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 match we match pretty well you know we're usually good vibes not too much arguing not too much complaining or any of that and we like playing with each other. A lot of people question, is it, are Aix like a big question mark? Like, oh, Aix hasn't been placing well. Aix hasn't been, hasn't been doing well these past years. But I really felt like in Jetpack games, he was just struggling. It just wasn't his type of play style. He was really inconsistent. Like some games he'll play really well, and then some games he won't play so well. And I feel like in Boots to the Ground, that's not going to be the same thing. I feel like he might have his inconsistent games here and there, just like anyone else. Not everyone can always play perfect or do well. But I feel like he's going to be a way better player than he was in these Jetpack games. I feel like he's going to step up to the plate. And I feel like he's tired of losing, tired of mediocrity. And I feel like he's really going to, you know, do his best. I believe in Aix and I believe in his potential. And I know that he can be that beast. He can be that monster if he really wants to be that. And especially in the boots in the ground game. So and now you, a lot of you guys know he ha he's has he's had a lot of success on boots in the ground. You know him. You know he's won like multiple events in a row. He's won a lot in Black Ops Two and Ghost. He's a world champion on boots in the ground. Like he knows what he's doing. He knows what he's talking about. And th that's another thing. A lot of people are questioning. Like oh, you guys have a lot of you know a lot of captains, a lot of leaders in your in your team. Like you guys are gonna be butting heads. I don't really think that's the case. We actually scrimmed uh, today, and you know there wasn't really any butting heads. Like we're all mature. We're all 23. I, I believe we're all 23 years old. You know we're all mature adults. You know here and there it's gonna be a little bit butting heads, and we're gonna maybe argue. You know sometimes, but. I think we're mature enough, you know, we understand how to take criticism and to how really soak everything in. We've won before, we've all experienced winning, we know what it takes to win, and I think we're, we're all level-headed, like we're not really going to let it get too ahead of us. Maybe Aix is going to get a little bit carried away sometimes, but he knows what he's saying. I think we all can, you know, be a voice on the team. He is sort of considered the leader of the team, but I don't really think that's going to be an issue. And he's sort of going to, Ace is going to be sort of be like our flex player. Then we also have Enable. Enable is basically our main AR in the team. Another question mark, a lot of people are like, I don't know how Enable is going to do. Like, he is a good jetpacks. He was really good in jetpacks. But I don't know how he's really going to do in boots to the ground. You know, he didn't really play boots to the ground. And I completely understand that. But again, I have faith in Enable. I think he's going to be a beast. He's We just need to, you know, you got to teach him a little bit. Maybe some anchoring tips and stuff like that. But he's a beast, man. He's won events. He knows what it takes to, he, like, everyone on the team has won before. We know what it takes to win. And, you know, it's just, it's learning. It's a learning experience. A lot of the players that are coming, that are considered jetpackers, like people from E-United, Gunlist, maybe, you know, pre stuff players that came through jetpacks games and people really thought, oh, they're going to be only jetpackers. No, they're going to be good at the game. Maybe not as good, maybe not as talented, maybe turned down a little bit, like, oh, slightly worse. But they're still going to be beasts. They're still going to be good players, in my opinion. So Enable, I know he's going to be an animal you know it's all we're all gonna learn together we're all gonna teach each other and you know we just gotta teach the fundamentals and stuff like that and i think he'll be an animal i think he'll you know just be enabled bro the, the beast in the back just brr, brr, just beaming kids you know i have faith in enable man i have faith in my whole team that we're gonna be dominant and then of course you have nameless now nameless is actually something you guys did not know but i should have teamed with Name nameless back in ghost we were supposed to be a team that never happened nameless Another beast, uh, just just a really good player. He's gonna be sort of like my sub duo, and he's here and there gonna pull out an AR. But nameless, just you guys know him. I'm in you alive video. If you guys never seen that video, go YouTube it. 
um this great just great vibes uh great energy you know gets hyped just like i said mature uh he knows how to how, knows how to approach things knows how to take criticism knows how to give criticism and just just a player i've always wanted a team with you know he might he may have not had the best last year performance and people gave him a lot of shit but i think he he played really well pretty much for the most part of all year uh didn't get the play, best placings of course and you know he did place top 32 of champs which really sucks i've been there before with top 16 i've been there before and i know what it feels like and he's just coming out with the fire this year he's taking it really serious and he i i, I can just tell from the vibes just from the whole team in general we're all taking it extremely serious this year you know we're not messing around at all you know, we're not streaming scrims or we're taking it. We're just taking it super, super serious. And I love that about this team. You know, no, no, just no time to play around, man. We're about it. And I really love that. You know, we know we want it, man. We really want it. So I'm really excited to be teaming with Nameless, a.k.a. Zeus, a.k.a. I'm Poseidon. So we're Zeus and Poseidon. You know how we rock and baby. And it's just a good team overall. So basically, Ace is going to be like the flex. He'll run sub and AR uh, here and there, depending on what we need and what map. Uh, Enable is going to be our main AR slash anchor sort of role. And Nameless is going to be our sub and then pull out AR here and there. But basically my sub duo. So that's the team. I'm really excited for this year. Trust me, guys. You guys have a lot of doubts about um, bumping heads and all these little things. I don't think any of that's going to be an issue. The main thing is just going to be coming, to, just preparing, preparing ourselves for these events and then performing at these events. That's really going to be the only thing, you know, standing in our way. If we can do that, if we can practice really well, which I believe we can, and we go to these events and just perform and do our thing. I think we'll be really good. I think we'll be a really good team and we'll definitely give a lot of people trouble. So just a little update roster slash announcing kind of video that I was supposed to do a long time ago once we announced, but I never really did. Uh, I was having some issues with my camera and stuff like that, but decided to finally post it now that World War 2 is out and I'm freaking loving the game. So thank you for watching. Just a little update video. Hope you guys enjoy your day. Have a good night. Have a good afternoon. Have a good morning. Apathy is out.